that can link in a bolt bag. Just gonna throw this net over it. Pallet of 90 of the smaller nets, and then a, a bolt bag of kiln dried. You can tell because I've got a standard bag, and then two uh, two kindling for a customer. That's first delivery done. Um, at the moment, all the kids are on summer holidays, and nearly every parent says oh i'll get the kids to pack them away i don't know whether it actually happens or not but it's worth a try i suppose so i'm just going to drop this kindling off at another firewood producer um who tends to buy kindling off me because they don't do any themselves they just do the firewood so a lot of people would say about that is you're helping out a local company but firstly there's plenty of customers for everyone you're not going to get every single customer secondly if I wasn't supplying them they would just buy off someone else so I might as well make make the product and sell it Very much. See ya. Tighten. Log log. As you can tell, this section of the track has got really bad. Um, so I've actually got some recycled crushed hardcore coming in this afternoon and I'm going to um, blind it off try and make it a bit smoother it's not good for the little tyres and the trailers and stuff like that it's just waiting for it to puncture really so get the kindling and they always give me their pallets as well some of them are bad, I just put them through the burner and then some of them are used for my kindling and log nets. Can't complain though, we're already here, might as well pick them up. They're free. So we'll get the pallets in the back here. I haven't got to the point where I'm putting a camera in everyone's face and uh, filming everyone when I'm doing anything. So around there when I was dropping off the logs, it was pretty busy and 
I'm not quite at that stage yet. So, hence why I don't film myself when I'm dropping off logs and stuff. I don't really want to film people's houses as well if I can help it. Here comes our man with a forklift. On and gone.
I've had a bit of crush, crush dropped off by apps. Dan was nice enough to uh, spread out the track for me. Makes life quite a bit easier here. together as well as I thought so when it rains over the weekend I'm going to come down and track it in as it's raining and that'll push all the air bubbles out and uh, and bind it all together that's what I did at that bit further on I actually rolled it in when it was wet and raining and it um, it kind of held the water but then once the water had run out of it it was super tight and it would, wouldn't go anywhere so I'm going to do the same it's nice and smooth. Um, it just, as I say, it's not binding together. So even if I kept rolling, I don't think it would do too much. I'll, uh, I'll wait for it to be a bit wetter. Ideally, you would have a Bowser and you would soak it now and bind it in while it's hot. But um, it's gonna rain over the weekend and then it's gonna be warm uh, early start of next week. So. I'm sure it will go pretty hard then. Just keep trying. 
trying to take it. Some of this stuff is actually good enough for kindling.
machine spun and then the whole machine's on the train. <laughs> well, luckily I got no attack, but it's just how much suspension the fuck walked around. not bad it came off a local um, a local site where they were pushing back brown, uh, boundaries uh, back to the ditch and then they did re-ditching as well so they saved all the straight alder some of it's a bit small but it'll be okay for a smaller processor some of this could go for kindling um, alder does make nice kindling it dries quick as well so who knows maybe I can pinch into it but I think I might just start stacking up as much small stuff as possible and um, get enough to justify possibly buying or renting a small processor for a period of time we'll have to see but yeah that was a bit of a bonus we're going off to site we're gonna have a big burn up of some smaller brash that they couldn't recover just to tidy the site up ready for uh, replanting all right guys that's it for today hope you enjoyed it let me know what you think in the comments and i'll see you on the next one